Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the deep playthrough of RE7 Biohazard Resident Evil. Just had a cool fight in the garage over here with the dude of the house who didn't really uh, survive it, but he has like major regenerative abilities, so he will be up and standing shortly. Holy shit, my frame rate tanks suddenly. Not sure what's up with that. Here we go. What the hell? Why is my frame rate totally down the drain? Like seriously down the drain. Ah, this is what I need for that door in the hallway of the house, I guess. Alright, can I pick it off? Not really sure what to do. Ah, we have an ox statute. Man, I don't hope that now finally the game is actually doing HDR suddenly, and that's the reason that my frame rate suddenly tanks. Because it's pretty damn low suddenly that would mean that all the previous episodes still were not HDR the first two somehow weren't HDR the game simply even if I start capturing in, in HDR the game refuses to keep it that way but now the frame rate suddenly is way lower it feels like it feels way more sluggish so it could be that now suddenly HDR is enabled although it looks pretty much the same as before Whatever, maybe there's stuff going on in the background. Um, I have no idea how to get out of this garage, to be honest. Or what to do. Could try to shoot those chains. Or open the garage door. Hmm. You tell me. I do have like this statute, so I could use that. Hmm. Here, I can get past here. Nice. All right, here we go. Is 
it's still yes it's still very low frame rate it's almost uh, I was afraid of this this is not doable uh, yeah ex actually not playable anymore so somehow the game was still not really doing HDR, I think. Only now it starts to do HDR. It's so annoying. Really, really annoying. I made like all these like a thumbnail and stuff saying 4K HDR and stuff. But that was all pretty useless. If I have to change it back, either I will have to start playing at 40, 40p, 60, or 4K, 30. One of the two. Probably I will go for 4K, 30. Alright, let's put that coin in there. Ah, I have shotgun shells. Need shells packed with pellets. Let's save it again so I don't need to redo this. And I will try to continue with this low frame rate only in this episode. Just to see if it improves somehow. This is hardly playable. This is really like me in, um, I don't know how long ago, 2008 or something. Playing S Crisis 1. Can it play Crisis? This is mostly the performance I got at the time. Right, here we go. Let's put this one here. Ooh, nice. Still need another one, I guess. No, I don't. Right, we're in the hallway. Very nice and also very Resident Evil-like. All right, I do have to cut this episode short. I will pick up the phone quickly. I knew where it was. But this is uh, the frame rate is just really crapping out somehow. Where? <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, where the hell is that telephone? Shoot me, shoot me. All right. There is the telephone. But I was too late. Did my daddy give you a hard time? That's your father? Who used to be? I'm sorry, but he, he, he's, a, he's dead now. 
You just might be able to pull this off. What? Pull what off? There's something I need you to do, but I can't explain it right now. You may need some sort of keys to do it, but find a way out of the house. Okay. I'll be in touch. I must say that Ethan remains pretty composed. Really cool, that shadow in the wall really puts you on the wrong footing, thinking that there's movement. I'm not sure what the shadow is of. Ah, of that little ventilator fan on the table. It almost seems like only now either HDR kicked in or the textures are went into high gear. It is annoying. All right, I will quickly scan around a bit. A lot of puzzles, which I actually really like. Sky Hunter. All right, we need some kind of uh, bird thingy for that. We need to put a bird silhouette on that pedestal. Louisiana chips. Not much here. Man, they did do a good job of creating a believable shithole house. Ah, a herb. Gunpowder, I assume. Gunpowder that can be packed into bullets, combined with chem fluid to create handgun ammo. Alright, we need... It looks like a three-headed dog, but the heads are missing. So that door is locked. That door is locked. By the way. Mia is probably also still um, around. That's pretty closed shut. Over 20 missing in two years. Captain Howell from State Police told reporters that they have started to search for Helen Midkiff, a college student from North Carolina who was traveling in Louisiana. Mrs. Midkiff hasn't been heard of since the night of the 21st. Reports of missing persons in South Louisiana have increased dramatically in the past two years. The majority of those missing are tourists and vagrants. At least 20 people are thought to have gone missing so far. Police suspect foul play and believe there may be a connection between the incidents. Plans are in place to step up local interrogations and increase personnel to further the investigations. Alicia Ashcroft, January 19, 2016. Do I need, I have 10 bullets, 20 bullets I have, I could create some more, but yeah, let's just 
stick with 20 for now. Also, let's see what we can make. We can bullet, make bullets or um, medicine. We can go upstairs. And we have a shotgun. Very nice. All right. Hmm, I was afraid of that. Bummer. So I need something to hold this mechanism down or something. They are pretty ingenious. Those crazy people of this house. Anyways, guys, I am uh, ending the episode a bit early. I will have to uh, adjust the settings because it's not really playable at this frame rate. Especially if I have to make, uh, I'm in a chase or something, I have to get out of here quickly. It's hardly doable with uh, this stuttering and like sub 20, 30 frame rate. So guys, uh, sorry for that. Um, it's, it's just the game itself. It's really random with its HDR implementation. Um, uh, I'm, I'm not sure what's going on. It's a bit of a shame for a game that has been out for so long that stuff like this yeah, is not patched out. Uh, but it is what it is. I hope you still enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, a share, or maybe even a subscribe. And hope to see you in the next one. For the meantime, don't forget, always do. Keep on gaming. See you later.